to get exfoliating gloves which nobody in jamaica has <laughs> and i'm just so frustrated because they don't have any um but they got a lot of products here so if i see any affordable products i'll buy myself something well no i won't i'm not gonna buy myself anything what is this um um oh this is the lotion that i use let's see how much it is it's one thousand seven hundred and thirty dollars don't know how much us that is feel free to use google to check the exchange rate um i when i was living in new york i used to always use okay no i lied but i would buy um tanning lotion to try to get like a darker like this color that i have now because let me try to show you what i what i look like but lighter that's what i look like but lighter yeah, so it's kind of funny. I used to use it, um, something like this to get a darker look. But uh, I don't need it now because we got the sun. But anyways, I don't see anything that I want here. Uh, yeah. Um, not sure. I do know I need a tangle teaser. I think we're going to also go upstairs and see what they have. In the furniture department. What is this? Oh, this is nice, but like the bristles are a bit too small. Let's see what this one's like. Oh, this is eight hundred dollars. It's not bad at all. This is cheaper than like a store that I went to in Portmore. The the price, but I'm not sure if this is gonna be good for. I bet it should be. I just don't want it to be too flimsy. But this is cheaper than for what I saw in Portmore. It's not the actual Tango Teaser brand. I think the one in Portmore was. Um, look at all the hair products. Look at all the hair products. This is the Eco Styler that I recommend. This one's hold is at 10. Well, the all of them say 10 but trust me this one is really this one's really strong and they're selling it for 650 mm, prices have this is okay now this is a smaller jar this price oh yeah there's a let me show so that's the one i have this aisle <laughs> that's not my aisle we skip in this aisle we're skipping all the aisles but i do need to start like <clears throat> getting tools get a kit ready and everything you know how much is this oh that's not bad 1199 that ain't bad at all kennedy tools well phillips are never heard of kennedy before <clears throat> Stanley, I've heard of Stanley. Why do they have Kennedy, Phillips, Stanley? Where's a Rebecca? Where's a Rachel? Where's a Monica? You know, you get me? Anyways, 
but I've definitely heard of Stanley. Oh, this is a staple gun. Oh, that's cool. Oh, like if you're doing like tapestry and stuff like that. I don't know what else you could use it for. Um, plywood? I don't know. I do need a flashlight. $415, not bad at all. Oh, I'm gonna get candles upstairs. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. They didn't have what I wanted, so I'm not gonna. Ooh, look, it's the Valentine's Day aisle. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you. I've only been in one relationship ever that ever um made me feel like that gave me teddy bears. But my mom. I guess this is this season's pillows. I do think this is cute. This is very cute. I would buy this. I need to start decorating more. $6,599. Do you guys think this is worth $6,599? Let me know what y'all think. Um, I'm gonna stop speaking on what I think and I'm gonna ask y'all in the comments to let me know if some of these things are worth the price because maybe they are because I have no experience in buying these things. Oh, this would be so cute with this. This and this is starfish. This is somebody with the price tag. Oh, <clears throat> uh, I have the slightest idea how much this is, but it looks like it was six. That looked like that could be a six, right? Six thousand two fifty. That's what it's looking like. <clears throat> I don't know. And then let's look at one that is cheaper, which is $2,599. This one's 18,000. It has a wireless charger though, so I can see why that's so much. But still. So let me know. I'm just gonna share the price. I'm gonna remove my opinion. And y'all can let me know what you think about the prices. I just came up here for some candles because I want to put up some candles. <laughs> What's oh, a book stopper? We have found the candles. Should I get red for the season? I don't want to get red for any season. Um, oh, the other Fontana had better um, cute decorative candles. I don't have anywhere to place these, so I'm not gonna just put the raw candle down. Ooh, what's this? I gotta smell it. It smells like, this smells nice. Not gonna lie, that smells nice. Hemp and Earl Grey, I don't like Earl Grey tea, but that smells pretty good. I don't wanna break it. So let me be as careful as possible. Chill. One's from Christmas. So these were these are two hundred ninety nine dollars. I don't think I paid that much for mine. Oh, I like these little candles. I just don't have the little stands to put them in. Yeah. yeah. Um, <clears throat> these are so cute. I guess you can buy these separate and buy. Doesn't fit. <laughs> it doesn't fit. But you can buy it separate and put your candles in it. This is really cute as well. Don't have any smell. It smells nice, but these definitely smell better. So they're worth the price. Let's smell this golden amber one. 
they smell all three of them smell nice the bamboo lotus bamboo lotus golden amber hemp and earl grey and let me see what this wild hemp and hope smells like you know i don't like the smell <laughs> i don't like the smell of this i don't like the smell of this one at all it's not mine not my smell i really want to smell there we go this smells really good Ooh, i like it these are one of the um the type of i have no idea what they're called but they make a fire cracking noise when you light them i believe this smells nice it smells like it smells fresh like sea breeze kind of smell that's what it gives me but this smells this is the best one golden amber smells really nice but i think this This is this in itself is a skill to take this off with one hand. Yeah, this is the best smelling one by far. I would buy this one. Three thousand three thirty-nine. <clears throat> But these are handcrafted. Home sweet home Jamaica. That's cute. How much is it? Six thousand three hundred and seven. I guess they're handcrafted, so I guess. They're cute. I don't know what time they're closing, so I'm gonna hurry up. And I'm gonna probably have to put music over this. Because copyright. These are very cute. Um coasters. I believe they're coasters. They're very cute coasters. $4,500. Let me know what y'all think about the price. Oh, I got more candles. Okay, seems like their candles are roughly in the same price range. This smells heavenly. This smells really good. Oh my God, this smells so, this smells, Somebody come buy me this. Should I buy this? I need to see how much it um how much it costs in US dollars. This is nice. It definitely has a citrus. It's definitely citrus breeze. This is definitely citrus breeze. Definitely citrus breeze. Winter harvest. I could do a candle smelling haul for you guys. It smells nice. It smells generic. Holy berry smells amazing. I could buy that. Zen. Let's see what Zen smells like. Zen smells like coffee. Let me see. Do they have the ingredients? I hate when they don't have ingredients. Or at least what soy wax essential oil infused. No, I need to know what's in here. I'm telling you, coffee is in here. Coffee is in here. I don't know. Coffee has to be in here. Coffee has to be in here. It smells like a coffee drink that you'd get from Starbucks. <laughs> I like the way Holy Berry smells. Holy Berry and Zen smells the best to me. Oh, they got another one back here. Inspired and Jade Harvest. So okay, these are going to be the last two I smell. Inspired smells generic as well. Like I smelled it before. I don't know how to describe it, but I smelled it before. Dang, they got apple oof. Okay. Okay. Let's just do this and get it over with. <laughs> oh, this smells just like that's weird. Jade harvest inspired. Inspired. They smell very similar, but where's the lid? very similar but i don't know all right beautiful people so i'm gonna get some haagen -Dazs. i love talenti ice cream but there's nowhere in jamaica that has talenti so i'm gonna get haagen -Dazs. um it's probably gonna be overpriced but i'm gonna eat this while i watch a movie tonight um i'm also looking for let's see what they got in the snacks aisle i don't want nothing on this side i don't want no doritos either i think i've had way too much snacks this week anyways so 
I'm going to, I have no idea what I'm going to do. Should I get a Ferrari Shay? This one's just 365. Well, it's just 365. This one's 365. They have some of Mega Oil. I'm gonna just get three. I'm gonna just get three. Um, yeah, I'm gonna just get three. And I like Cadbury. Um, but. <laughs> I'm not trying to break out. I finally got my skin to clear up. So this is really all I should be getting. Uh, let's see. Guys, I've been sitting <laughs> right here. Like I turned off, I turned off literally at the end of this car this parking lot this parking lot with all the cars that's where i turned i've been here for the past <sighs> i'm almost done with one episode that's all i gotta say <laughs> i'm almost done with an episode um i also met a financial advisor i'm gonna turn the camera around so you can see me i met with a financial advisor just now at such core um, he was really nice and he was very helpful. Um, but I'm thinking about it. He sent me over some some stuff to read. So I'm gonna when I get home I'm gonna read those. But damn this traffic! I barely moved. Like barely moved. Um, yeah. And I need to pee. And I'm hungry and I bet there's traffic obviously there's gonna be traffic on the other road that I have to turn on to and I'm telling you shorty like I'm hungry I'm so hungry I want chicken I have chicken at home but I'm gonna the chicken please make a call somebody and ask them to buy me some food I'm gonna get them the money when I reach and all these bikers you know what bikers passed me already I need a bike my paypal information is down below uh, if you want cash at me or sell me just send me a private email my email is down below in the description but i need a bike money <laughs> because this is not it this ain't it it's traffic mm -mm. i need a helicopter that's what i need <laughs> not like I could step out of this vehicle at this this not even it's not even moving and I hate these coaster buses like I, dang anyways um I could step what the heck I thought I turned you off I could step out of this vehicle and walk and reach my location and still not reach the end of the next road it's crazy the next lane have three lanes be like empty crazy empty this has two lanes and it's packed and the lights changing so quickly like is there an accident that i'm unaware of we just want to get to the next lane because from me get to the next jeez i'm peas i'm gonna turn off over here so me is a big yamed oh my god my chats are clear <laughs> i'm sad I could have turned off on that road because that road could have. Chat can't much me. I'm a chat thorn dog. Like, I really was not paying attention. I could have turned off on that road where, where these cars are turning off at right now. Yo, somebody if you can rig this light and make it constantly no that no, that wouldn't make any sense and this lane not moving to save its life like a walk one the light green like why there's two lanes from over there there's two lanes from over here we're on halfway halfway tree road look green light nobody can move and i think there's only i think there's four lanes on this road um if i'm correct there should be four if not three but it's definitely not two lanes 
So either three or four lanes. So I'm just wondering why the hell can't we move? And the thing is, I think they're supposed to have a red light right now. That lane can't be going in when we're going in. So something not adding up. Me not care about the light and not the camera. I care about it, but still, I'm done underneath. I'm gone. I'm past already. Come on, man. Look on this now. So it's three lanes. I thought it was four. Why is something that doesn't myself four? Hurry up, no brother, before the light change. Well, you get chopped. Not a box foot and move. Look at that. Traffic, man. Mm. It's rush hour anyway, so I can't blame it on anything. But I think it would be very beneficial. And I don't like complaining unless I can give some solutions or some ideas on what to do. I think they really should get some police officers some traffic officers well they are police i think they're police officers. traffic officers and police officers are the same thing but they need some traffic officers to come and do some because the light and the amount of um the density of the vehicle the density of the traffic itself and the, the um the consistency i guess i really don't know how to word this of how the lights are changing it's just not adding up it's not adding up and something just not moving right like something not making any type of sense and then you know what too and then people make money i know come one by one of them and eat some of that how much for your cashews i'm hundred dollar my friend I'm give me a hundred dollar one here come hungry bad hungry bad 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 so this is the 200 dollar bag just imagine what the hundred dollar Mr. Me can't buy this one dollar. We need more, like one, one fling and a gun. You get me? But I love cashews. One of my favorite knits. So, guys, ain't nothing for me to talk to y'all about here. So I'm gonna, gonna just enjoy. This I move faster though. Not like this I move for that lane's not moving any faster. This is moving faster. So what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna suck it up and make a turn on the bottom road. I don't remember these road names. Like I know them. I think okay, let me try use some Walt. No, Hagley Park. No. Hagley Park? Hagley Park. No. This road but hold on, Mega gonna brother, 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 sister, sister. I'm gonna pull up the names of I'm gonna turn onto this road, which is going to lead me to Hagley Park Road. And then from Hagley Park, I'm gonna turn on to Waltham. And yeah. My interview was pushed back to 10 30. It was supposed to be at 10. But yeah, I look so yellow. I'm wondering if it's the hair or if it's me or if it's Maybelline. But yeah, so I'm just getting familiar with the area. I have my laptop to take some notes. I like taking notes on my Mac, but my Mac don't like me without electricity. And I don't want to ask, can I plug this in? You know? So I'm gonna do the Dell. Um, I love this laptop. It's touch screen and you can flip it into a tablet. You see how right there it looks? I need to get a case for it. Let me show you. <laughs> this is how I smile in my mask. This is not smiling. <laughs> um, it flips. Okay, I'm not going to show you because that's just a recipe for a disaster. But believe me, it flips. 360 all the way into a tablet which is so cool um but yeah i'm just getting familiar with this area i don't know what's around here um, i'm seeing some boutiques and stuff like that their clothes is a bit more geared towards older women i know in the fashion world they like to say a more mature woman 
but I don't really like that tone. What's back here? I don't really like that tone as saying certain clothes can only be mature if you're older. That's not the case. So, I'm actually tired. This is my outfit, by the way. Don't mind my pudge. I don't have a pudge when I stand straight. I do, but it's whatever. I'm gonna find somewhere to sit down because I'm quite tired. Yes. I'm all sitting here. This place is cute. Oh, they have some office spaces. Hold on, let me find out. But well, it's kind of in like, they're kind of tucked away, I think would be the right word. For these places, they're tucked away. One second. A very, very beautiful view though. Um, pretty sure there's Blue Mountain. I believe. I don't want to say the wrong thing here. Um, but I think I'm not gonna say which hills is which hills, Stony Hills, Red Hills, Beverly Hills. I'm not even gonna honestly I need to get a bit more familiar. Like I know it when I'm there, but I can't point it out from here. Which is so weird because I recognize some buildings, so I know. Like I know the area, I know once I'm at like the foot of a certain hill, what hill it is, but um, so pretty. They have some nice shops up here. I'm gonna stop recording and look at inside of these places because they're cute and small. Guys, I'm in Walmart, I mean, <laughs> I'm in Mega Mart, which I was going to say reminds me of Walmart. In a way, it's like a lot more, a lot more stock. Um, one thing I need to find out if they have exfoliating gloves, because that's what I've been, that's been my mission for the whole week to find, which is so hard to find. Um, I think it would have been in this aisle, but I don't see it. The next thing. I want to find the Pampers for Grandma. Guys, look at my engine. Looking inside of my vehicle. So I had some problems with the radiator. So it's all fixed now. Basically the top, the top, um, somebody and I come in, so let me help. The top tank um burst so um yeah that's that but it's fine now they fixed it guys i'm back in my baby um they still have some issues though they still have some issues i'm gonna have to go to the ac man but the radiator and everything like that is fine my nose has been itching me. The, the um one of the men in the mechanic at the mechanic was um doing some body work and the dust, I think a lot of the dust got up in my nose. But anyways. Still gonna have to do some work. This is the Salvation Army right here. Um do Jamaica, Kingston headquarters. And this hold on, sorry. I don't feel like flipping the camera. This right here, hold on. This building right here is the Nigerian embassy. You can see their flag, which is so cool. Devon House is right across the road, but you guys seen, um, not the embassy, the Nigerian High Commission. I apologize. Um, yeah, so I have to go to the AC man because the fan that comes on to cool what I believe is the in the radiator and possibly cool the engine as well, I'm not sure, but definitely cool down the radiator. Um.
Pedro Sandré, Pedro Sandré.